Welcome to this overview of the Advanced Browser Security Extension by Perception Point. The extension is able to block malicious file downloads, restrict file types, save users from interacting with phishing web pages, uh, report everything back to the admins, and also provide some additional DLP functionality. So let's take a look here. You can see that we have a, a malicious URL here in our SharePoint site, RFP URL. If we click on that, uh, we can see that the site is blocked and that it'll explain why we're blocking the site. You can also customize this message if you'd like to. If you hit show details, you can see that the users have the ability to continue to the site. If we click through to actually go to the site, uh, you could see that it is a bogus phishing website designed to steal credentials. Now that was live scan. So if this link came in from any source and the user opened it, uh, that would be scanned and remediated. Likewise, if there's a malicious file download, you can see that the file is being scanned in the top right here. Uh, and once the file is completed, you can see that it's a malicious file and it was blocked notifying the user they can't interact with the file. Now, both malicious links and malicious downloads will show in the X-Ray platform with a full-blown analysis of why the file was blocked. In this case, uh, the file was detonated inside our hardware assisted platform. You can see a bunch of information about the thread itself, in this case, a macro. Uh, based on the code analysis. If we scroll down a bit here, you can see that there was an exploit in Microsoft Word 2010 as well as 2016. We could take a look at some screenshots of the file. You can see that a macro is attempting uh, to enable and execute malicious code. If we scroll down a little further, you can see in the assembly code uh, where the process was violating uh, the execution flow. You can also see the scan process information as well as the uh, execution of the macro and the snippet of the macro here. Now, if we hop back in and look at some of the other functionality here for a DLP perspective, you can see that there is an executable that we have denied. So users are not allowed to download executables and the file is restricted and blocked. Additionally, you can also control copy and paste functionality. So here we have a CRM and we say we don't want anybody to be able to copy from this, uh, this CRM web platform. You could see we're attempting to copy the data, paste it into Word, and you'll see that it was blocked. Uh, this is true also, uh, we can also look at it in Pastebin if you want. You can tell that the clipboard itself just has the blocked text on it and is not actually copying the data from that page. Additionally, print functionality can also be disabled. You'll see that users can still attempt to print, but no dialog will appear on the page. That about wraps up for some of the high level features and DLP controls inside the advanced browser security extension by Perception Point. But if you have any more questions, please feel free to reach out.